This is the setup to test the Fiero speedometer. Uh, let's get the parallax arrow out and give you a better view of it. So it looks like it's right on zero. The meter should be straight up and on an angle um, from what you would view it, just like in the car. So I'm going through sending pulses at various pulse widths to very you know, simulate the speed. And around 10 miles an hour, you see it's a little jittery, and that's because the uh, control loops in Arduino are in real time, but it's uh, not a real time controller. There are interrupts and overhead in the code. So I just coded this real quick to get it go from 0 to 120 and back again. And you can see that it's, it's pretty much does all the speeds. Um, it's very silent. You can hear the uh, motors turn for the um, odometers when you get up to around 120. They get really, you know, they're still very quiet, but you can hear them. So I go up and down, and you're going to have to email me for the code. My email address is at the end of this video in the credits. And right after this quick little video, I'll have three slides that tell you how to hook it up. So, you know, it's a quick way to uh, check it. And if you set the um, 60 mile per hour compile time switch flag to a 1 in the code and recompile, this will output a signal for exactly 60 miles per hour so you can calibrate to that one speed. And it's going to go back to see it gets a little jittery. That's just because of the control loop and delays and interrupts. And there's the Arduino. So let's go on to the slides.